One of the most powerful drilling fluid tests measures the property of filtration and includes the filtrate volume and filter cake thickness. In reality, the filtrate is the water or liquid phase of the drilling fluid that is available to react with the formation and the drilled cuttings. It appears there are a lot of pieces to this particular test, but they are really very simple to put together and use. We have a frame and the associated parts of a cylinder to hold and pressurize our drilling fluid. We start with the base and we have a gasket inside. We add a backing screen and on this screen we'll put a piece of filter paper. Add a second gasket and attach the barrel. Pour in a sample of drilling fluid to be measured. Put this assembly in the frame. Install a CO2 cartridge. We have the top air assembly. We need to add a gasket to this also. Attach this assembly to the top of the barrel. We'll be putting this cylinder under 100 pounds of pressure, so be sure the set screw is tightened securely. Put a graduated cylinder underneath to collect the filtrate. Turn the regulator in to get 100 PSI on the cylinder as shown on the gauge. Set the timer for 30 minutes. Filtration rate is measured in milliliters of filtrate per 30 minutes of time. We've run the test for 30 minutes. Now turn off the pressure at the regulator and release the pressure from the cell. Remove the top assembly. Empty the cell. Take it apart and remove the filter paper. The solids left on the filter paper is the filter cake. Rinse the cell in the filter cake. Measure the thickness of the filter cake by placing a ruler in the cake and measuring the thickness to the nearest 32nd of an inch or the nearest millimeter. This filter cake is 1 32nd of an inch thick. Read the filtrate volume in the graduated cylinder to the nearest 1 tenth of a milliliter. The filtrate volume here is 4.2 milliliters for 30 minutes.